Hi folks, Jason Clemens here from Clemens Boats in Sandusky, Ohio. Today we're taking a look at our 2016 Sea Hunt 25 Game Fish. As you can see here, we have the gray hull on this boat with white bottom, fiberglass T-top. Real nice looking boat. Gives you a little bit of color, but not too much color. Something a little easier to maintain. Big bow flare. Sea Hunt's claim to fame. That's true Carolina flare. Over a 50 degree dead rise at entry. Real good riding dry boat. Just shot of the port side here. Again, titanium gray hull side. Real good looking boat. We just got this boat off the truck. Can be sold with or without the trailer. As you can see here, it does have a dive door on the port side. That's a standard feature on the boat. This boat is powered by twin 150 Yamaha four strokes. It's a great running boat. You can cruise at 30 very easily and it's very good on fuel. Top speed in the mid 40s. You do have a nice pull out uh, swim ladder on the back. Just a shot of the starboard side here. Again, real nice looking boat. Powder coated T-top. Stainless rub rail. Gives you a little bit of flare with the hull color, but not too much where it's hard to maintain. It's not going to show water spots like a darker hull. A little bit less maintenance. Bear with me here as I climb aboard the boat. I'll take a look. I'm going to climb through the dive door. And we'll get started looking at the inside here. Bear with me for a moment as I climb up. As you'll see upon entry here, this does have a dive ladder, by the way, to make it even easier than the stern gate here to get in. You do have a nice rear bench that's removable. You got a big fish box here in the center of the transom. That's insulated, does have a gas arm on it. Of course, your live well here on the starboard, or I'm sorry, the port corner. Pop up stainless cleats. You do have a uh, starboard side walkthrough with a gate. Raw water wash down. Tow rails with nice combing bolsters and of course rod holders there. You have another live well here at the leaning post, which is again powder coated like the T-top is. Nice powder coated uh, leaning post there and then you've got your powder coated T-top here. This T-top does have a mister system and LED lights as you can see. So on those hot days you do have something to keep you cool. Of course electronics box. As we saw from the outside there's a dive door. That's a great feature, awesome for getting in the water and out of the water. It's got a real nice ladder with it. It's also great for a dock if you don't like climbing over the side, if it hurts your hips. You can jump right out on a dock. It's real slick for that. You do have a freshwater shower here uh, in the seat. So you do have a freshwater system on the boat along with the raw water here. And again, the mister system on the top to keep you cool. That also runs off your freshwater system. As you'll see here, nice deep boat, lots of walk around space. You do have twin flip up bolsters. So somebody can stand and somebody can be seated and both can be comfortable. It does have a flip up footrest on the leaning post itself. Then you have a footrest on the uh, dash at the helm here as well. You do have armrests, so you can sit down and have a place to put your arm. Makes it a lot more comfortable to run the boat. And of course you do have four rocket launchers here on the back side and four on the top of the uh, T-top as well as the rod holders in the rest of the boat. As we move to the helm here, you do have a small storage drawer, of course trim tabs as you can imagine. This does have the upgraded Yamaha gauges. It's got the command link gauge, all your toggle switches there, LCD screen, um, Bluetooth, CD player, I'm sorry, stereo. I'm having a hard time talking today. Uh, with USB auxiliary port, plenty of room for electronics. We like to leave it up to our customers on these, whether they want Garmin, Lowrance, Simrad, Raymarine, we can put whatever you want in there and up to uh, the maximum size. So if, if you're not looking for a, a 15 inch Raymarine touchscreen, you don't have to pay for one or Simrad or any of those for that matter. You do have bow backrests up here in the front that are removable. Nice big wrap around bow here with anchor locker, of course, here on the front. Again, pop-up cleats here on the bow. This boat is available with the windlass. We did not put it on the boat, but we could add one very easily if you needed to. Storage under all your cushions up here in the front. You also have 
uh, your forward facing seat here that's super comfortable and then you do have another storage pot in the floor one real nice thing about these are is the way the uh, T top post here are mounted in um, you get a lot of space to walk through here so they're a little more integrated than some where they stick out it makes it easier to walk through it does have an electric head again there's your dive ladder that does hook into the floor your battery switches are also down here as you can see does have dual batteries as I say in all these videos there's tons of features on the boats we can only get so many in a quick uh, inventory video here we but we want to give you an idea what the boat looks like other than just pictures I think this gives you a lot better idea what you're looking at if you have any questions on the boat please give us a call at 419-684-5365 you can have one of our sales professionals go over the boat with you in a little bit more detail of, or of course set up an appointment to come see the boats although it's cold here in Ohio right now we do have all these boats inside to be able to be looked at so rain or shine five degrees or 80 degrees you can look at boats in comfort you can also check us out at clemensboats.com while you're there don't forget to like us on Facebook and check us out on Twitter at Clemens one and again we know you're gonna have questions when you do please get a hold of us we'll go through this boat or any of the boats that we have explain them to you and we would love a chance to earn your business. Thanks.